American Black Bear versus Asiatic Black Bear. Which is the strongest black bear and would win a fight? The American Black Bear versus Americanus and the Asiatic Black Bear versus Tibetanus are two different species of black bears found in North America and Asia, respectively. While they share some similarities, such as their black fur and omnivorous diet, they also have some differences, including their physical appearance, habitat, and behavior. Black bears, the most well-known and prevalent type of bear in North America, inhabit forests, mountains, and swamps. They are skilled tree climbers. Despite the name, black bears can exhibit a range of colors, including blue-gray, blue-black, brown, cinnamon, and rarely white. The Asiatic black bear or moon bear owes his name to the prominent V or Y-shaped light-colored mark on its chest. It is a medium-sized bear species native to Asia that is largely adapted to an arboreal lifestyle. Size and Description The American black bear is a medium-sized species of bear native to North America. They are typically 4 to 6 feet, 1.2 to 1.82 meters in length, and weigh between 100 to 600 pounds, 45 to 272 kilograms, with males being larger than females. They have a characteristic profile with a hump of muscle on their shoulders, a narrow waist, and rounded ears. Their fur is usually thick and shaggy, providing insulation against the cold. Their paws are large and padded, making them excellent climbers and swimmers. American black bears have strong jaws and sharp claws that they use to forage for food, climb trees, and defend themselves. Despite their name, they are not always black in color. The Asiatic black bear are medium to large in size, with adult males weighing between 220 to 440 pounds, 100 to 200 kilograms, and measuring 5 to 6 feet in length, 1.5 to 1.82 meters. They have large rounded heads and small eyes. Their large ears are placed farther apart on their heads than the American black bear. Their body is heavy, with strong, thick legs and broad paws. Their tail is short, two to four inches in length, and can barely be seen from underneath their long, coarse fur. Their black coat is marked with a light-colored chin and a white V-shaped chest patch, from which their other name, Moon Bear, derives. Stay with us until the end to find out who will win this fight. Don't forget to subscribe and press the like button. Thank you. Range and Habitat Black bears are common in the forests and mountains of the Pacific Northwest. They can also be found in forests in Canada, Alaska, the Rocky Mountains, the Upper Midwest, parts of the southern United States, the Appalachian Mountains, and even Mexico. Individual black bears have home ranges of 24 square kilometers, 15 square miles or more. They will rely on different food sources throughout the year by following seasonal landscape changes. They are commonly found near wetlands and early green up areas in the spring, and near large berry patches in the summer and fall. They frequently travel on man-made trails abandoned logging roads and game trails. Unfortunately, the moon bear is only found in fragments of its former range. They used to be found all over southern and southeastern Asia, from the Middle East to the Himalayan mountain range and into Southeast Asia. Their distribution is currently extremely patchy. They are found in small pockets throughout their former range. Despite the fact that humans have wiped out much of their former range, they still have a surprisingly wide distribution across southern Asia. This bear lives in a variety of habitats, 
depending on the season and time of year. They prefer humid forests with a lot of rain. To avoid the heat, bears spend the summer in mountainous forests. As winter approaches, they migrate to sea level to avoid the freezing temperatures in the mountains. Bears forage in agricultural areas, meadows and open grasslands, but they prefer dense forests. Diet Black bears are omnivorous, which means they consume both plants and animals. They rely heavily on their sense of smell to find food, and it is believed that they can detect a food source from more than two miles away. Berries, fruit, sedges, and insects make up the majority of their diet. They will also eat fish, honeycomb, and human food and garbage on occasion. Black bears may prey on young elk and deer in the spring. They will even steal the carcasses of these animals that have been killed by another predator, such as a mountain lion. Asiatic black bears are omnivorous, but primarily vegetarian. Fruits, seeds, grasses, roots, tubers, honey, acorns, mushrooms, insects, small prey, and carrion are all sources of food for them. In the fall, they eat a lot of the nuts from Phagaceae trees, which include beeches and oaks. Their keen sense of smell enables them to locate insects up to three feet underground. When food is scarce, these bears will eat anything, including domestic animals and produce, and will even strip tree bark. Farmers frequently kill bears in order to protect their crops and livestock. Behavior American black bears are solitary animals that roam large territories without protection from other bears. Males may have a home range of 15 to 80 square miles, 39 to 207 square kilometers. When winter arrives, black bears spend their season dormant in their dens, feeding on the body fat they've accumulated from eating ravenously all summer and fall. Female black bears give birth to two or three helpless cubs in the middle of winter and nurse them in their den until spring, when they all emerge in search of food. The cubs will spend about two years with their overprotective mother. The behavior varies slightly by region. Some bears are diurnal, meaning they are most active during the day, while others are nocturnal, indicating they are most active at night. Nocturnal bears typically live in areas with higher human interaction and thus emerge at night to avoid humans. Depending on the region, some moon bears hibernate all winter or part of the winter. Bears wake up easily during their hibernation period. Who would win a fight? American black bear versus Asiatic black bear. The outcome of such confrontations would depend on many variables, such as the age, size, and health of the individual animals, as well as the location and environment in which the confrontation takes place. It is also important to note that both American and Asiatic black bears are generally shy. They will typically use their keen sense and agility to avoid danger rather than engaging in physical confrontations. Both American and Asiatic black bears have sharp claws and strong jaws, which they can use for defense and to obtain food. It is difficult to determine a clear winner between an American black bear and a moon bear. In general, American black bears are larger and more aggressive but moon bears are known to be more agile and have powerful jaws. If both animals were in their prime and the American black bear is larger, it could likely be a close fight, but I think that the American black bear would win this fight. But if these two individuals would be roughly equal in weight, I think the moon black bear would win six from ten fights being slightly more robust, stronger than his American counterpart. Also, 
The Asiatic black bear might be able to withstand higher stress loads during an intense grapple and have a higher bite force. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button. Until next time, farewell.